Today I'm talking about power windows. I'm going to show you how to do two different things with your Ford power windows. How to restore the one touch up functionality and second, how to recalibrate a window. This is an important thing to do if your one touch button stops working and in the second case of recalibrating a window, if you replace a window, a window regulator, or a window control button panel, you may have to recalibrate the window. I'm going to show you how to do this on my 2013 Mustang GT Premium, but this will work on any 2011 to 2014 Mustang. Before I get started, I want to say I have many other videos you may be interested in showing general automotive work, modifications, and tips. If you find this video helpful, consider subscribing and watching the other videos. To subscribe, just click the Styles Automotive icon in the lower right of the screen. To restore the one-touch functionality and to recalibrate the window, which I'll explain later, we're going to start with restoring the one-touch functionality first. This has to be performed with the door closed. Calibrating with the door open will cause the window to continuously bounce back. Functionality may be lost under low battery conditions. So if your battery is extremely low in your car, that can cause a glitch in the system and cause this one touch feature to, to go away. To restore it or reset it, after ensuring you have full battery power, turn the key on, pull up to the one touch position and continue to hold up until the window has reached the stall position and then hold for an additional two seconds. Press the switch down to operate the window to the full down position. The one touch will now be functional. You should be able to hear my window operating in the background. Recalibrating the window is similar. The door must be closed, the power on. If the window will not raise after the door is closed, use the switch to fully raise the window then hold the switch for two seconds. If the window will not lower when the door is closed, use the switch to fully lower the window, then hold the switch down for two seconds. Immediately after releasing the switch, pull the switch up to the fully raise the window and hold the switch up for two seconds after it's fully raised. That should recalibrate the window. That concludes the video. Let me know if you found it helpful in the comments, and if you did, please subscribe.